busy night of high school hoops on Tuesday. It doesn't get much better than the central manual rivalry and the two Peoria city rivals meet for the first time all year. They go head to head at Peoria High where the Rams are trying to dive into a Lions lead. Idius Robertson gets good position off the missed free throw and he'll score here. Later the Rams are running. Gerald Traps ahead to carry on Pharrell for the hoop here, but the Lions had the lead and they kept the Rams at bay. Stashawn Kelly ahead to a streaking LaShawn Stowers for two here. And later Kelly will follow the play and score on the rebound and the Lions beat their rivals. They beat Manuel 57 to 45. Big game in the middle line I race. Morton playing host to Washington. Tremendous game that goes to overtime in the OT. Washington takes the lead with Isaac Mapson scoring two of his game high 24. 10 seconds to go. Morton's down two. Loose ball out to Gus Rugard. And the sophomore drills a deep three. The Potters are up 63-62. But enough time for the Panthers to get one shot for the win. Drew Lewis to Jamari White. In the corner, a three for the win. The game-winning shot. Washington 65-63 overtime winners at Morton. Good small school matchup. Peoria Christian playing host to Elmwood in the Trojans. Andrew Marincic is a flat out scorer, folks. Look at him in traffic scoop that one in. But the Chargers can score the basketball as well. Malachi Persinger with the impressive attack of the basket here and scoring in a crazy play to end the half. Drew Goring's pass gets deflected off the backboard and right back to him. He beats the buzzer. 66 45, Peoria Christian beats Elmwood. To Mackinac, where Deer Creek Mackinac plays host to Eureka in the Heart of Illinois Conference. The Chiefs' Lucas Blumeyer slips a pass to Gabe Schurman for the nice hoop, but it's another nice night for the Hornets. Trevor Heffron penetrates and kicks to an open Carson Gold. He makes the three ball, and here uh, Heffron is down low. He's going to pump fake and score, and Eureka is a 57-28 winner at DMAC. National Guard night at Peoria Heights. The Patriots wearing special uniforms for their game with North Fulton. Kamarian Richardson with 17 points for Peoria Heights. Hits that three here. Illinois across the chest on the, chest on the Patriots jerseys. Later, Connor Barnes a pump fake and a hoop. Peoria Heights wins by 20. More on those uniforms in just a minute. Girls basketball state ranked Notre Dame playing host to Limestone. And off the pick and roll, it's going to be Biz Daly attacking the hoop. And she'll score on the nice pass from Maya Wardle. Then off the inbounds play, it's Wardle to a cutting Delaney Cook for two. And a terrific night for that Irish guard, Maya Wardle. How about 12 assists and no turnovers? She sets up Caitlin Cassidy here, and Notre Dame wins at 75 to 27. We're jumping in the pool for the inner city swim meet at Normal West. In the 200 yard freestyle, Normal Community's Josh Fujimoto with an impressive showing. He wins that race. U High's Camden Swigart is a big winner, uh, winner in the 200 IM, but the iron with a big night. Tyson Tucci blazes to the victory in the 50 free. Normal Community with just 11 swimmers wins the inner city title. Other winners in boys hoops, Limestone, Illini Bluffs, El Paso Gridley, Central Catholic and Prairie Central, and in girls basketball, Brimfield, Normal Community and Peoria High also win. All right, in Kurt's Corner this morning, we're going back to Peoria Heights for their first ever National Guard night. The Patriots wearing Special Illinois Army National Guard uniforms, camouflage on the collar and the arms, piping along the side in camo, American flag on the front. Very impressive, and even the cheerleaders are wearing camouflage at Peoria Heights. Nicely done in tonight's Kurtz Corner.